I feel like I don't bend that way. <laughs> there you go. Those Who are, should have that? Those are hot. I feel very Mary Catherine Gallagher. Spelling bee. Hey guys, it's Bo and Kelly Brotherton with Better Together Life. As YouTubers, eventually every YouTuber is gonna get uh, an email of a company wanting to send you a product for you to review on your channel. It's just part of marketing and that's just how it is and most of the products are terrible. Like you would never <laughs> reply to it. But when a company like Ariat contacts you and says, hey, we wanna send you some boots. You say yes. Yes. Yeah, if you want the short view of it, absolutely 100% we love it. But if you wanna know why, then keep watching. No reason to stay on the ground. Pick your hands and you And let's start with this, that we've been wearing Ariat boots for a while now. In fact, the very first time Bo got the yeah. bug for, <laughs> for, uh, doing anything homesteading. Like, honestly, guys, I think we had tomatoes in a garden. Bo these was like, I'm ones. gonna be a farmer and I'm gonna get these. And these are the original boots. I think they're probably six years old. They're still well, well in their life. They're called the work hogs, I think. They're yeah. very comfortable. I'll put all, the, I'll put all the, the, the models down here. I have an unusually large foot for such a short woman. And I'll tell you, I've worn these a bunch of times and they're really comfy. But when they asked us if we wanted a pair of boots and we got to choose them, I did not choose work boots because I don't do a ton of like the heavy lifting out here. But what I do still do is teach a lot of classes and take our kids into town for co-ops and things like that. So I wanted a pair of boots that I loved and felt really cute in. And I kind of thought the same is that I had my- Work boots. My work boots and they're all beat up. And I yes, I could have gotten- But they're in great shape still. They have I know, a lot they really of life are. left in them. Yeah, they really do. So I could have gotten the same things, but it just, so, I got a boot that I would never yeah. <laughs> ever buy. Ever. Yeah. I got. <laughs> it is a waste that guys can't show off. That's true. Their the, cool boots. The prettiest part of the boot. I got some fancy pants western boots. Like look at these they things are cool. so cool looking. And they smell so good. All right, so here's the lowdown on these boots. They're called the Josephina. It's actually my grandmother's name, so maybe that swayed me a little bit to buy these. They're a super cool boot that's already a little bit like rustic beat up, so getting a fashion boot like this, I wasn't worried that it was going to get ruined real quick. All the like beating that it's taken just walking in our back pasture or going into town or loading hay bales into the truck, it's taken it all and it looks really beautiful still I wear it I wore it to a baby shower just the other day so I love the Josephina boot for that now here's the tricky thing about it though if you like just a super cute Western boot that you can put on with a dress or your jeans this one you want to size up on so like I said I have an unusually large foot for such a small person and we can blame <laughs> your beautiful feet we can blame all my babies for that right but normally I would wear like a nine to a nine and a half these ones I I had to size up to a 10. The first pair of boots that we got, I put them on and I just could not get my heel in comfortably through it. And then I had that awkward moment where I'm laying on the floor, my foot is up and Bo is yanking the boot off me. But we had really great customer service from Ariat. They told us, why don't you try sizing it up? Sent us a new pair and we returned the others. And this size up, it's a 10. And this size up works for me. It's so easy to get on. And as soon as I wore these boots in within like a few days. So sizing up on this one was the way to go. It's a perfect fit. And I can't say enough good things about these boots. My feet are super happy. These are probably boots that I wear almost every single day. And I can say they're the most comfortable shoes that I own. This is my turn. These are the Arena Rebound Western boot. So there, I, because I am coming from the work, work hogs, boots. the work boots, I did experience a little bit of a different feel than, you know, what I was expecting. So just More being- snug. No, it's just, I mean, I've never owned a Western boot. Now, nothing at all wrong with that. It just fits a little bit differently than the work boot. The work boot, you could tell that it's designed to last 
to where you're gonna be working in it. So it's designed for, for comfort and just like a little bit more cushion and all that. I don't remember at this moment breaking these in. You've put them on, fit like a glove, right? Yes, away. so I mean, that just, I did. And now at the time, I know that I was wearing uh, different pants, just being honest. Like I had a whole lot more blue jeans and now I'm having, <laughs> I don't know why, this is a weird thing that I'm wearing different kind of like pants nowadays than this. And so I think that with the Western boot, with, with the rebounds, it, it, it has this different shape that I'm not quite used to you yet. You need boot cut pants. I think I do, I think I do. So whenever I'm wearing the pants, that it it makes my shin look huge like here in the front. Um, I just didn't see it going this direction. So I'm really glad you're sharing this because I had no clue that this was on your mind. I know, these are the <laughs> coolest looking boots that I've ever seen. Definitely the coolest boots that I've ever owned. I am very excited to wear these like whenever we go do office hours or anything like that because I just think that they're so you do like wearing cool them. looking and they are extremely comfortable. Yeah. It's a, it has a different kind of sole, a bunch of like little bumps that kind of like yeah. massage your feet. I mean, it's a very- A friend of ours is a professional musician and when I was asking for input from my Facebook friends and I said, hey guys, I'm getting some boots. What do you recommend? What's like cool to get right now? And he commented and he said, Aria is my favorite boot to wear. I'm on my feet all day long and he said no boot is ever as comfortable as when he's wearing those and I have to say you said the same thing wow they're so comfortable sure they're very very comfortable now compared to you can see the the sole so the, the sole thickness. yeah the thickness of the sole is smaller but that's not that big of a deal it's definitely a different bottom this is for working that's what she this said. is <laughs> this is for the hoedown. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> and I need to get some new pants to really see if these things fit because whenever I'm wearing them, it makes my shin look giant. So like compared to yours, yours are all like this. Like they're really soft and they're like, they're floppy at the top. I haven't gotten these things worn in. I think the work hog, they didn't have that flare on the front as much as these Western boots. Besides all that, as soon as I get new pants for these, like look, you can see this, there you go, look. So you see how <laughs> this is what I'm dealing with. Kelly needs to buy me some new pants that really are a little bit wider. It just, I got skinny legs and this, nice legs. this just makes it look all wonky right there. But look how cool these things are. They're, They're really so cool. tight. Look, So as long as I get some, I need some bell bottom. No, I don't. That, that. will make you feel very much cowboy-like. In 70s, 70s homestead bell bottom feel. boots. That would be sweet. You can tell by the way I use my walk. I'm a woman's man, no time to talk. That's what it will feel like when you walk down our road if you do that. Please do that. Thank you so much to Aria for allowing us the opportunity to review these boots. We love them, they are awesome. The links are below. Remember to size up for the Josephinas and that's it, we'll see you next time. Okay, now this one we're gonna do slow-mo, but my camera doesn't do slow-mo, so we're just gonna walk really slow down the step. Okay, you ready? So step, ready. take a step back. Okay. <laughs> and now go. <laughs> People, don't look at the camera. What? Don't look at the camera. <laughs> and don't fall. Go. Don't fall. Now, 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 You're really slow. Don't look at it. Just like kind of highlight I the boot. You have to highlight the I boot in the view. Just go. Yeah. There. Keep going. Almost there. Nice. Cut. Got it.